Hello, I'm Skid, and today we're going to be giving you a quick look at Ixion. Uh, we'll just be covering its multi-monitor capabilities and the fact that it appears to be working pretty damn well. Uh, it's selected the right resolution out of the box, um, but there is a lot of options in here. Probably too many. It would be nice if megahertz was a separate one, because if we go through all of these all the way down right to the bottom, here are the ones for triple monitor or triple wide, at least triple 1080p. Uh, you can select the monitor that it can go on. That's actually a very useful feature if you have more than one display. My alternate display is just a single 1080p monitor on uh, my alternate graphics card um, that I do my recording on. So this is a nice option to have. It's not one that's useful to me. Frame rate, V-Sync, anti-aliasing, and then some fairly bare bones graphics options. It would be nice to have a little bit more in there. But anyway, Let's quickly go into the first part of the tutorial. I quickly ran the game just to make sure it isn't just the main menu. This isn't vertical minus. This is horizontal plus. I hit check. So we'll open up Delete Me just to show you what it looks in game. As it stands, pre rendered cutscenes appear to be horizontal plus and fill all screens. So pre rendered appears to be um, 21 by 9 aspect ratio. Um, there doesn't appear to be a frame rate limit on it, although I suspect the videos are only 60 frames per second anyway. Um, In-game cutscenes, that's what the one I was trying to refer to say, uh, in-game cutscenes are full scale, so they render across all screens. Uh, and again, don't appear to have a frame rate limit. So I think, yeah, this has hidden the tutorial message, that's fine. But the overall majority of the HUD seems to be centered. It does appear like... Anything that opens a window, opens a window along the central panel. Uh, if we come over to the tutorials, this is all in the central panel. The main menu appears in centered. And everything is bound within uh, my middle monitor. That includes this here. This is perfectly within my middle monitor, as is the game menu. So it looks like they've actually gone out of their way um, to make sure this is all scaled and works correctly. Um, I've not done... Uh, I've obviously not played the game yet because we're planning on doing a playthrough of this which will start next week. I need to either record episode one um, after this has been uploaded or first thing tomorrow morning. Um, but that'll be next Monday morning and we'll be starting the playthrough. But yeah. At first brush, I cannot see any problems with this. It looks like they've actually put the effort in to get it working in multi monitors properly. Which is awesome. Anyway, we'll leave it there for today. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the show and hopefully we'll see you on Monday. Cheerio.